you find superheroes everywhere today. But did you know that some believe that the world's first superhero came from Dimchurch, England, in the form of the mask-wearing 18th century smuggler, Dr. Singh, who inhabits the pages of Russell Thorndike's novels. Now the superhero concepts has been turned into a multi-billion dollar movie industry, transforming ordinary people into spandex-wearing guardians of the universe at comic conventions. But I think we need to concentrate on the most important ingredient, the people, the local heroes. Welcome to the Perfection Selection, a Green Cards TV. <laughs> If you like time travelling, then subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the like button to preserve our heritage for future generations. So let's go back in time and space to meet the author who coined the term Time Machine, H.G. Wells. He lived in the beautiful village of Sangate in Spade House. In the neighbouring town of Hive, he chose this lovely building for the inspiration for the bookshop in his Mr. Kipps novel. Hattie Jakes, best known for playing Matron in the classic British carry-on films, was born in this spectacular blue house in Sangay. Noel Reddin played a crucial role in the Jimi Hendrix experience as the bass player. Did you know a young Noel? made his first public appearance at the Hive Youth Club, which was apparently located around where this book of flats is. St. Leonard's Church is famous for its crypt, which contains thousands upon thousands of bones, whose origins nobody fully knows. But if you go out the back, you'll find the grave of Lionel Lukin, an inventor whose safety lifeboat probably saved thousands of lives. Folkestone has had its fair share of celebrities too. Since YouTube is the latest iteration in the world of motion pictures, I thought it only right to feature probably Folkestone's first ever movie star, Kitty Gordon. So, let's unroll the world's smallest cinematic screen, turn the lights down low, and show a clip from Kitty Gordon's debut film that came out more than a hundred years ago in 1916. Now that you've seen that video, you might want to see the others to complete the series.